All right, guys, you've got someone here who wants a brand new beginning with you in love. Okay. This person here, the challenge out here is for this person to initiate something. Okay. That lasts. Keep the outcome here. Mm. I think you're trying to move on from a connection out here that didn't work out in the past. You're dealing with a player. Okay. That's what's happening here. The root of the issue here is that this person out here right now is thinking, waiting and watching if they want to invest into this connection right now or no. What's on your mind is the page of swords here. So probably you're keeping an eye on this person here. Okay. You're not literally communicating with them. Okay. Just trying to get more information about them. Okay. But you're not ready to take action as yet here. Uh, I think you're just trying, you're just talking them. That's what you're doing. You're just waiting for them to make a move towards you. Because in the past year, I feel this person out here was trying to make a decision. They kept you on hold here. This person wasn't making a choice, you know, sticking to their comfort zone, sticking, uh, you know, to something that they know, you know, they had the fear of unknown here. So that's why they weren't making a decision here. But right now, I feel there's someone here who needs to come towards you or who wants to come towards you, you know, very in and out energy. But this person out here is to, the, the, the blockage out here is to take that action, to take that initiative to come towards you. Only then you're going to have a brand new beginning here. Uh, in the near future with the page of wands in reverse, looks like there is either some bad news or there's still that procrastination going on here. Okay. Let's see. Okay. I'm just going to start clarifying. We'll, we'll see. What's the page? What's the two of wands here? Yeah. You drop this person out here because this person was indecisive, right? They will give you a very on and off connection, very unstable connection. And uh, it's lack stability out here, okay? Which is why this person made you on, put you on hold here. You could have turned your back to this situation, okay? You could have like probably just turned your back towards them because they were just sitting on the fence doing nothing about it. What's the page of swords? This is on your mind. Yeah, see, you're you're probably wanting stability, commitment, security here, okay? So you're probably just, like I said, right? Just keeping your eyes open. Keeping your eyes and ears open. Just trying to get more information here, waiting for this person to come towards you. But at the same time here, you could be probably very, very uh, focused on your money. Money looks good. Money looks good. What's the Knight of Wands? Yeah. So you're dealing with someone here, you know, who's probably very defensive okay this is the kind of person who wants to come towards you this is very defensive energy this is someone here you know who replaced the same story over and over again you could have had a very bad ending with this person out here but this person that you're dealing with right this person here is someone you've blocked out okay energetically emotionally uh you know on a physical level here but this is someone here who probably you have your guards up towards okay that's the kind of person who wants to come towards you so they could be chilling in your block list right now Ace of Wands, why is this here as the influence? This is the pocket. Yeah, see, this person lacks optimism out here. Okay, this person does not have a lot of hope and faith that things will work out between you both. They're not being able to see things in a more positive light here. Okay, they probably are not being able to take action. That is why, you know, because this person feels that things are just over and done between you both. And even if they come towards you, there are very slim chances that you're going to take this person back here. What's the seven of pentacles here? That's the root of the issue here. Seven of pentacles. Yeah, this person is still not making a choice, right? They're still at a crossroads out here. They know they need to make a very, very strenuous, you know, a very difficult, tough decision. You know, there's a lot of tension going on here. But it's like they're waiting and watching what to do next year. But for right now, they're choosing to stay emotionally very detached from you. They're just choosing not to see the situation, hoping that things will work out in their favor automatically or hoping that the situation will just go away. For right now, they're trying to choose... Uh, staying away from you trying to block you out uh why is because they want to uh you know avoid any kind of unnecessary drama what's the page of wands in reverse here it's still lack of communication the near future page of wands in reverse three of swords in reverse Okay, so this person definitely is your soulmate, okay? You feel a very strong soulmate to inflame connection with this person out here. I think this person is trying to heal. What's the three of swords in reverse? Yeah, see, this person wants success and victory with you, okay? So there is a there is procrastination coming from this person's side. You know, they're putting off a situation, putting off a connection, uh, you know, on hold. Instead of putting in action and making things happen. That's what's happening here, 
that's what's happening here. Although this person would want victory and success with you, they want a reconciliation with you. But where's the talking? Where's the move, baby? You're choosing to walk away with the Six of Swords here. You're choosing to create that physical and mental distance between you both. Relocate or just like let it go because it's not working out. Six of Swords, please. Yeah, because you have a very uh, negative mindset right now. You know what? You're both in a very negative mindset out here. You, so it's like this. This person has a negative mindset, okay? They're, not, they, they're very pessimistic right now because they feel it's just not going to work out between the both, so they don't take action. They don't take action, so you, on the other hand, are even more in that negative mindset here, okay? You are also losing hope because you feel they're not taking action. So you see, you're both mirroring each other out here. Try and get yourself into a more positive mindset and it's probably going to work out, okay? Probably right now, you're not being able to manifest. Even if you're manifesting, there's more positive. There's more negativity in your head rather than positivity, okay? So that's what's happening here. You just feel it's never going to work out. What's the Three of Cups in reverse? This is in your environment that you don't see coming. Three of Cups in reverse. There's still a lack of you guys coming together, yeah. You're being impatient out here. Okay, this person out here is being impatient. Probably they just feel it's a fail, long distance relationship out here. And they just feel there's just too many blockages out here between you both. Okay, too many obstacles, too many blockages. But overall, this is more like um, a pessimistic attitude. Okay, very impatient person out here. This person needs to make that decision. They need to make that call. They need to take action. Till they're not going to take action, they're never going to be able to see anything positive. Okay, that's one thing I'm getting here. The other thing I'm getting here is that this person here is probably very toxic, okay? They're, they're coming from a very toxic environment here, okay? But they're just very disappointed here that this, you guys are still not being able to come together. It could be that this person has a lot of demands, okay? More than demands, it's like they can't cope up with the demands that this re the relationship is asking for. Maybe you're asking for commitment. Maybe you're asking for something more solid. Maybe something more stable, okay? Something where you guys are not on the same page is what I'm getting here. This person realizes that there's a lack of you guys coming together here or on the same page, okay? Because there's too much to do out here, okay? And this person is just, um, you know, not ready to see the bigger picture out here, okay? They're still not prepared. You know, they lack planning. This person lacks planning. This person lacks taking action here. They're not brainstorming. They're giving up too fast. Wheel of fortune in reverse in your emotions. Why is that? So you feel things have changed for the worst out here, okay? And you're probably ready to just take a leap of faith and move forward is what I'm getting here. With the temperance in reverse here, I feel you still don't have trust and faith in the connection. In the universe more than the connection out here you probably are ready to leave ready to make a move forward out here okay because you just feel things are just not on your favor luck is not on your side a lot of frustrating delays between you both out here okay but delays 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 is what i'm getting here okay and like i said they're not making a move so you're in that negative mindset you're not uh going and, and um you're probably and probably they expect not expect what's the word and they know what you want and they're not being able to give it to you so they're in a negative mindset you know so it's both ways you guys are just like anyways they're gonna get back as the outcome here if you continue holding back communication they will come back seven of swords in reverse what's that seven of swords in reverse yeah but they're still coming back non-committed all right they're coming back they want to come back but they're still still coming back with a lack of stability security if you want the commitment it's still not happening out here okay this person is trying to revive the same cycle that happened between you both okay they're still dwelling in the pain they're still emotionally unavailable is what i'm getting here this person has a lot of fear of resentment fear of rejection you know this person here has trust issues out here someone's still unavailable emotionally so yeah this person keeps coming back to you it's an on and off connection you know so they'll keep doing this over and over again every time you take them back every time they're gonna leave every time they're taking you take them back things are gonna be all hunky-dory it's gonna be all uh, fun and games it's gonna be like nice emotional fulfillment but the moment you ask for something committed they're gonna run away okay but yeah this person is still coming back to you indecisive okay you on the other hand here i think you're pretty much prepared to leave what is where it is you know because you know that things are not changing there's a situation that's just going nowhere okay and for you and it's very important for you with a full year that you take that risk and you move forward and that's exactly what you're doing here
that's what I have for you, okay? Hope this reading resonates, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.